Uh, Mr. O'Brien here. I'm just here to kind of give you some help and show you a, a couple little tips here to to do the, the work from home. All right. So obviously you're going to be logging into Google Classroom and on the stream itself, this is where you're going to be spending uh, some of your time. So make sure that whenever I'm posting new things, it's going to show up here. Um, just to give you an example, today's assignment, right? This is what you're going to look for. It says lesson plan. So today's lesson and the plan uh, for 1117, all right, which is today. Um, number one, it's all in steps, right? Sign into class attendance. This is required uh, because it shows me that you have uh, that you have at least seen the assignment, even though maybe you, you're not able to turn it completely in today. Um, just complete this no matter what. Um, every day that you're assigned to be in my class. All right, this this is showing me that you're you're technically here. All right, so please um, complete that no matter what, every time. Uh, then you'll be watching a two-part video series, which is the European Middle Ages part one and part two, or well, it's part 1A and B, uh, 1B. Um, complete the Medieval Notes Journal one in classwork. All right, so we've we've been doing notes journals uh, since the beginning of the year. Uh, nothing new to you. Uh, so just watch the two videos, and uh, we'll go, we'll take a look at that. So um, basically, uh, once you get into your classwork, you're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom, go down to Medieval Notes Journal, and right here you can view your assignment, and it tells you make sure it's, you're basically just making a summary what you learned, right? What did you learn from this section? And you need to have at least one question in there um, for your credit. So make sure that you're, it's a one paragraph in length. Um, I think I actually have the additional details over here, yeah. So uh, must include information from both videos. All right, so you have to have a little bit from both. Must be a summer, one paragraph long, all right? One summary paragraph in length and must include one question. Uh, and then anything else that you might be missing, obviously I'd like you to work on those and try and get that stuff in as well. Um, I also try and post this too, and this is gonna be extremely helpful, I think, to to a lot of people, but the, the problem is that most people haven't taken advantage of it, and it's my office hours from uh, 10 to 11.30, every Monday through Friday. It doesn't matter if you're in my class or not, but if you have any questions on any assignments, all you do is click on that link, and it opens uh, the Google Meet right up, and we're face-to-face, -face, live, we can talk, I can show you my screen, I can give you tips, I can uh, kind of help you right through your assignment if you need it. Um, like I said, most people are not really on there so uh, all the time, so I, I do get a few people that pop in here and there, um, but for the most part, uh, we'll probably be um, alone by ourselves on there uh, so we can kind of talk through things and I can help you through your assignment face-to-face. -face. All right, um, obviously the newer things start up at the top, all right? So right here's the new assignment that popped up, um, showing that it popped up in classwork. Um, there's the directions for the day, all right? But to go back in time, right, to look at older assignments, you can scroll down through here and you look for, again, that lesson plan. So here's the class before, lesson plans for 1110. Um, complete the class attendance form. Obviously, you don't need to do that now because that's an older one. Um, you're only doing it um, from here on out. Uh, make sure the previous assignments have been completed. I, I listed them out here. And then uh, I had you work on the medieval women in Western Europe questions and reading assignment, right? Um, make sure that you turn it into Google Classroom when you're done. Again, the office hours link, uh, and then lesson plans for even before that. So uh, going into where your classwork is actually going to be, and it's under the classwork tab. So right up here, we'll click on classwork, and there's your assignments, right? All the way down at the bottom, again, here's the top. Scroll all the way down to the bottom. We have European Middle Ages. These are the five assignments that have been posted so far. All right, so we have the Dark Ages debate. This one was actually due before you we went to remote learning. So this is kind of an older assignment. But again, it's uh, our first three assignments are very similar. 
So our questions come up first. And then uh, down beneath, we have the reading. All right, so the reading picks up here. And you can start looking it over and reading through and trying to find your answers to your questions. All right, one through six here. Um, do your best to answer them. Some of them are a little bit difficult. If you don't know what certain words are or what they what th certain things may, uh, may be, Google it. Uh, hop on Google and just plug it in and it'll tell you what it is. Um, so just do your best. There's a couple of critical thinking questions at the end, um, but for the most part, uh, this stuff should be in order uh, for the question. So we should run into this one first. And then after that, you should find this one and so on. Um, but do your best to try and answer, find the material, answer the questions in the reading below. All right, so there's your reading down here. So you'll just read through that, answer your questions. Same for the next two assignments. So we had that, was there ever a Dark Ages? It's the same structure, questions at the top, the reading beneath it, and medieval women in Western Europe. Questions at the top, the reading be below right beneath it. I uh, already mentioned your uh, medieval notes journal. So very similar to what we've we've done before. Same exact thing. Paragraph summary. Just watch the videos. It's my lecture. Um, so watch the lecture and uh, give me a paragraph of information and summarize it. Right. What were some of the main points, etc. All right. And then finally, uh, an earlier assignment also that I had posted. Um, what if it's a what if video? What if you live during the Middle Ages? Um, seven minute video. You watch it. You give me five main points. All right. List five. Whoops. Should have did that. Um, list five main points that you thought were important in the video. And that's all you got to do for that assignment. Um, all right. Well, I hope this helps out. Um, obviously, keep an eye on this section where I'm going to be continuing to add on additional things. Um, we have another one coming up here soon that's already scheduled for you, which will be coming up in a couple of days. Um, and keep an eye on the stream. This is the first thing that you should check when you hop in. Um, just look at the stream for the day. It'll say it'll tell you the lesson plan for that day. Uh, just follow right through step one, step two, step three, step four, however many steps there are. It's going to walk you right through completing your assignment for that day. All right. Um, I really hope this helps out. Again, don't be shy. Please email me if you have any questions. Um, join me during my office hours. Again, I'm going to be sharing this link with you every day, uh, every day that you're scheduled for my class. But you, even on the days that you're not scheduled to be in my class, you can still click on that link from uh, 10 to 1130, and it's going to connect me, uh, to connect you to me, and uh, we can talk. All right. Um, but again, I hope that helps and good luck. And hopefully I'll be in contact with you soon. So enjoy. Have a great, great week. We'll see you.